Hey everyone, it's MK. I am here to give you some more details about my track, the Pro Stitcher track for our MK Quilts Long Arm Extravaganza. I've already been getting a lot of questions, so here's what you need to know about Pro Stitcher with MK in November. I am basically going to do some project-oriented teaching. Well, what project, you ask? I am going to take this baby home tonight, get started on some ideas on how to quilt our wonderful MK Quilts education panel. And then I'm going to show you exactly how I did it. Now, you guys, if you know anything about MK, you know that I love simulation. I will include a little bit of simulation training in my session in November. But what I am planning for you all around this, this project is new content. So content that is not currently on my university platform. The other thing I wanna mention is that I really am looking to make my section open to people with questions or maybe that intermediate Pro Stitcher user who just needs to get a little bit over the hump and gain a little bit of confidence. So if anything that I just said is of interest to you, please get yourself here to MK Quilt, November 14th, 15th, and 16th. Get yourself signed up for the MK Pro Stitcher track and come and let me help you open up the floodgates and help you take your quilting to the next level with your Pro Stitcher. Well, I'm gonna keep quilting on these beautiful little placemats that you saw in the intro of the video there. It'll be fall in Florida, hopefully a little bit cooler, and I'm really looking forward to seeing you at our long arm extravaganza right here at MK Quilts. All right, everybody, bye-bye. Hello everybody, it's Paco here, and we are in my home studio in New Mexico. I am so excited about this long arm extravaganza. I have not been to Florida in about 25 years, so this should be a fun and exciting experience. I am so excited to meet all of you guys. I cannot wait. I am in charge of the designer track, and I have a ton ton of fun things planned out for you. We will be starting with the very basics of Pro Stitcher designer tools and functions. We will work our way up to line drawings, layouts, and rendering. We will also do a little bit of custom applique quilting. So I am excited about this. By the time we're done, you will have everything you need to create some pretty cool custom quilt layouts. And for those of you taking my designer track, you'll receive a digital copy of my Leafy Love Table Runner pattern in which we will work during one of our sessions to create a line drawing, layout and rendering, and even work to quilting it out on the long arm. So I can't wait. I'm so excited. See you in November in Florida. Hi everyone, I am Ellen Alt here for MK Quilts and I will be teaching at our long arm extravaganza in November. Now, those that know me know I love free motion. I'm going to disengage those gears and we're going to be moving that machine ourselves. I've been long arm quilting for about 12 years and I will say it is my favorite thing to do. I want to do the whole quilt myself, move that machine, come up with amazing designs that's going to show that quilt off and make it shine. Now in our course, we're gonna be starting with basics of what kind of tools you should be using, thread, needles, things like that. We're gonna talk a lot about the quilting path because we can make all of these designs up, but we wanna make sure it's as continuous as possible so we don't have to break thread. We're gonna look at density, so that way as you're working on these different designs, it's going to show off properly. On the first day, we're gonna look at a lot of different free motion fills. If you were doing it in a block or across a quilt, all these different design ideas so you can build up your own design library. And I'm gonna show you a lot of ways to add in variations to make it your own. Now on day two, we are doing rulers, right? I am so excited. Rulers really give you a lot of precision and really help a lot of quilters in free motion really feel a lot of strength in creating these designs. We'll start with straight rulers and look at how to ditch properly, look at straight grid work designs, and really what you can do with just a straight ruler. I'll say I use a straight on every single quilt I do. 
in the afternoon, we're going to pull out our specialty rulers, rulers that have curved edges, rulers that are a specialty shape or have a keyhole design. We're talking ribbon candy, we're talking petals, we're talking clamshells, we're talking circles, spines, all of these great different designs. So you can learn how to use specialty rulers that you may have sitting in a drawer or ones that you've been looking at like, oh, I think I do need that. Then Saturday, our final day, we're going to finish off with border designs. Borders are a great way to finish off a quilt and make them shine. We're going to look at some quilt math to look at how to break designs down. We're going to talk a lot about design choices with fabric because all of this work we're doing, we want to make sure it shows. You guys, I am so excited for this. We haven't taught in person in quite a while. I have all these ideas in my head and I can't wait for you to join us in November and take the free motion ruler track with me so you can disengage those gears, move that machine yourself and see that yes, you are capable of this. And oh, look what Ellen showed me. I had no idea it was this easy or this much fun.